The other thing that you may not realize is that with all of this funding, and we've updated now to over $600 billion in funding in fiscal year 2017, 84 percent of all the grants flow first through the states. So you may have a direct relationship with the federal government on your grant, or maybe you're getting funds passed through a state. But if you don't have a relationship with a state agency, if you don't have a relationship with HHS, you might be missing out on some of the biggest opportunities for funding. Because think about as we look at our projects and programs and what the problems we're trying to solve are, oftentimes the skills that you need and the objectives you have for your program can be very similar with just a little tweak to the training objectives. For example, if you have children that you're trying to help with an anti-bullying message, could it be that there's a grant out there for a self-esteem uh, type of grant? And both of those things are going to have similar, uh, similar needs and helping kids be uh, more confident and things like that. So always look, how could we do this funding where the bulk of the money is through states and from HHS?